Hi everyone, it's John. It's Tuesday, uh, July 18th, and I'm out detecting a, a park with my e-track. And I just had a higher 1246 type signal, about six inches deep, and I dug it. I was hoping for a silver, but I ended up with a um, King George penny, Canadian King George, and I'll flip it over. And it appears to be 1942. All right, off to somewhat of a start. I'll see what else I can find. Well, I just had a 1244 signal in this hole about uh, five or six inches deep. And over here, I think, maybe you'll be able to see, you can see the reeded edge of a silver coin. Um, dime size, so let's, let's see what it is here. It's a Merc. Wow, sweet. Um, I'll get a date for you in just a second. My glasses are all steaming hot. Um, bear with me, I'll, I'll, get a, uh, I'll get a date. Got it in the shade a little bit. It's a 1945. Really happy to have my first silver of the day. Okay, off we Good morning, everyone. It's Wednesday, July 19th, and that over there is Mr. Miles Davis. He's our older cat. Just a lovable big dude. And behind him are all kind of maps on the floor that I've been sorting through. Anyways, I was finally able to make it out detecting yesterday. It's been actually about three and a half weeks since I had really gotten out. And I'll show you what I found over here. Nothing real great, but um, you can see in the center I got a key and I did break the two dollar menu glad about that and my best finds were down here I got a 1945 mercury dime two Canadian King George pennies both from the 40s and eight wheat pennies and I believe most of these were from the 40s and 50s. I'll have to clean them a little bit better. A couple are, are upside down, I see now. But um, felt good to get out. It was a really hot day. Um, who I was wore out when I got home. But uh, made it worthwhile. It was fun getting back out there again. And uh, I hope to pick up the pace a little bit. All right, everyone. Thanks for viewing. And good luck on your next hunt.